A Polk County mother's push to bring back school recess is striking a chord not only in Lakeland but nationwide. Some Polk schools phased out the 20 minute free time years ago, but supporters are sounding off online. And the district is saying, hold on a second. News Channel 8's Josh Benson joins us from the playground with more on this ongoing debate. Josh? Well, remember recess? Ah, the good old playground. I logged a lot of hours on this thing. But Amanda Lipham from Lakeland says her son should get recess every day, not just once a day, which he's getting now. And people online seem to agree. They're signing her petition, and they're also blowing up social media. It is a buzz with Bring Back Recess. Amanda's Change.org petition blasted off overnight. Parents, friends, strangers supporting from far and away. This has been two days that it's just shot up, you know, unbelievably fast. So just super excited about that. I'm a teacher and I see the effect of no recess in the classroom, posted one supporter. If adults get breaks in an eight hour shift, shouldn't our children? Said another. All it takes is one driven mama to make some changes posted a Facebook user. Amanda's son Elliot gets recess on Fridays. Children at other Polk schools get it every day. It's school to school and I just think it's sad that you know some of our children are not being given that basic right. Kathleen Nelson homeschools her kids and is concerned with the idea of no recess. As a former teacher I, I know that that must make it harder on the teachers and definitely harder on the children. But the school board reaffirmed its stance in a statement that reads in part the school district has not directed schools to phase out recess. However the district does ensure that all elementary students have a minimum of 150 minutes a week of physical education. Education, this is a state requirement. As for Amanda, as many people as it takes, as long as it takes, um, I'm not going to stop until I can actually see the results in my children's education. And there is no sign of stopping. Her change.org petition is up to 1,300 supporters. That's about triple from what it was yesterday. Jen. Okay, Josh, the school says it's meeting the state's requirement, but you say it's each school's option to do away with recess, right? Yeah, that is right. The district says it's the school's decision, so teachers can use that time for creative instruction. So that means they can allow kids to get up, stretch, and do some other things throughout the day. So that's kind of their balanced approach, they say. But Amanda says just let the kids be kids. Jen. Nothing quite like playing outside. All right, Josh Benson live tonight. Thank you.